Hey, hey, hello, welcome on my channel, Tipal Chiu Tarot. This is Jagal TM and I'm back with another Pika card reading. This is requested uh, because a lot of you definitely wanted another uh, topic different from the love. So today, topic of Pika card reading is what is your life purpose? Your life purpose, your soul purpose, what you um, are mean to do this thing and uh, complete these things on this planet okay why you are born and where are you going where are you headed okay and what is your life purpose if you're already in this purpose or you are going to find this purpose um maybe today is a reading today is the day that you will find out and maybe it's a confirmation that you will find figure it out like where you need to go and what you need to do you know and i feel like a lot of you already in this life purpose you may be already doing this thing uh, or you maybe have some type of idea um, but um, keep in mind, this is a general reading. As I always say, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Because it's a general reading. A lot of people are watching this. So um, you can get a personal reading from me if you want it. Check out the description box and contact me on my email address. Okay, And the links that are given only on in this channel. Um, be careful from the scammers and fake people. Because I really want to, again, uh, now in my every video, I really want to tell you guys. So be careful. Uh, but only contact me through this channel, okay? Um, yeah, and uh, again, this is uh, this will be a de super detailed reading. Like, what is your life purpose, your soul purpose, um, what you mean to do in this lifetime, and everything all, okay? So there is a four groups with these stones. So choose intuitively. Pass the video. Option number one with this dark royal blue stone. Option number two is this seashell. Okay, and option number three with this beautiful green stone, uh, light green. And option number four, this is also the form of the shell, you know, it's seep. So yeah, choose intuitively whatever the pile is calling you. I will uh, definitely meet you on your reading. So let's figure it out together. What is your life purpose? And let's start the reading. Hello, pile number one. Group number one, the people who choose this beautiful, look at this, royal blue stone. Okay, so some of you, you could be Leo or dealing with the Leo. or But there are something is, is all about, because you chose this and this um, stone here. So this is something about reality here. You are definitely going to create a lot of wonders for a lot of people. So you're definitely going to shine. You're going to blossom. And I also feel like a lot of you, you are um, public... Um, speakers are you going to be you know I'm, I'm definitely picking up yeah like your third chakra is open are you going to be you know talk with a lot of people's so like audience i'm hearing audience you know so let's see more about this we have the prince of swords so you could be air sign does not matter we have the lovers gemini strong gemini i told you we have the ace of wands we have the artist okay <laughs> And we have the mother. And from the planets, we have the seventh house. Does not have to be. You have this or not. Because we all have these, these uh, signs, okay? Presence in our charts. But I will definitely describe the, you know, the detail of this. Seventh house is Libra. So you may be Libra. We have the Mars planet. We have this from inner child. And uh, I hope I make the space here so you can write this, right? So let's see. I think I have to do this. From this we have transformation. Look at this beautiful angels cards here talking about. Then we have learning experiences. Then we have from this we have choose your battles. This is seven of wands. Yeah. So we have the seven thousand seven. So you could be life path number seven. Okay. Uh, wow, wow. You guys are, I feel like your life purpose is definitely to explore, to talk, to to collaborate with a lot of people, to, you know, bring a lot of people together, you know, like uh, working in some type of organizations, uh, working some type of, you know, like fields. Um, I'm definitely picking up this is a Mars. This is like very driven, action-oriented thing here. This is also talking about... Uh, you are you have the power okay or you could be with the people who will you who are powerful you know and but i feel like this is about you you are creating power you guys are who the people who choose this uh, group here your um life purpose is definitely involved with power strength reality 
partnerships with the seventh house the definitely partnership with other peoples okay collaboration with other people's balance okay and trying to you know as much as do business you guys are business people and you are definitely mean to do these things contracts i'm saying contracts um partnerships with the lovers here also is talking about partnership it's this collaboration with other people's and dealing with other people's okay you guys your life purpose is definitely meeting you're not the people who, are, who will be introverted and if you choose this pile you are definitely on the wrong wrong pile or maybe you are going to find this purpose because i understand because you guys are introverted maybe you are virgo we have the learning learning experiences so this is like you guys are definitely uh, is a soul searcher is a, is a, is like you are always open for learning experiences and you are going to learn a lot of experiences okay um and also seeing that soul searching you're definitely going to find your soul purpose but at the same time your life purpose okay i feel like your soul purpose and life purpose is the same in this field whatever makes you happy whatever you want to do and create the things um a part of this i also feel like you guys are mean to do something like you know i'm saying that you guys will be artist okay artist could be any time any in, in any form okay so you you will create something for yourself it's not like you're you're under the people's so you will work with, under the people's that powerful people i told you 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 maybe have some difficulties to work with people's okay powerful people's okay because we have the mars energy you are really aggressive or you're really passionate about it you are the person who, who will you choose your own battle okay you don't want to you you are the competitor i'm saying here. You are the warrior with the Mars and with the choose your battles. You can see that you will be. I'm, I'm hearing that you will be in the top three. You will be in competition with people, okay? And you will always be, you know, battling for yourself with this artist energy. Oh my God! You could have a lot of um, competitors in front of you if if you are definitely in any field of um, artistic, creative. Uh, but I'm also seeing this could be a modeling. This could be a singing. This could be dancing. Anything, any way. You will create okay you are going to definitely sign a lot of contracts you are going to collaborate with a lot of peoples i'm also saying with the lover's presence here maybe you are going to uh, work with your lover okay you have this tendency to work with your partners uh, with your lover okay uh, it could be lover it could be your you know like soulmate your twin flame you have this mission to work with them too okay i'm definitely picking up here because i'm seeing with this mother energy um some of you you could be the mother watching this video right now are you are going to be a mother so definitely with this mother energy you have this tendency of healing and you have this energy of transformation okay to other peoples you could be working in your own crops okay i'm definitely picking up a lot of you could be this energy is talking about yeah i definitely feel a lot of you you could be you will be in a medical field or some type of therapist or psychiatrist or surgeons because with the mars energy you are definitely going to help those peoples who are battling within themselves this could be any you know mental issues or any health issues with this mother energy you're definitely going to be a healer for a lot of people to heal those wounds to heal those battles that they are definitely it's inner battles or outer battles definitely you're going to heal them but your life purpose is definitely here to teach to be a you know like a guru leader you you're definitely going to lead you're going to work with a lot of people so you're going to be a flourish and blossom in your own um creative ways okay and with this transformation some of you i feel like you will be um creating a lot of uh, different you know um business okay it is not like just one thing okay you will be multi a uh, talented person okay and you are definitely going to explore a lot of things and you will be the competition i'm almost saying that you will be in a top 3 a top 4 or something like that you will be very competent you will be very passionate about your work about your partnerships about your 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 field whatever you are in and you can see that with this um ace of wands this is another talking about creativity it's uh, i'm also saying with this sun it's solar plexus chakra you will be very your life purpose is is to bring this confident on the stage i'm almost saying that you are talking to a lot of people on social media talking you're you're exp expressing you know the, you you are definitely outspoken and you will put your voice out there okay for maybe you know for other people's to heal maybe you will also maybe stand out for people who are just bullying you know like stand against the bullies stand against the i don't know uh, you know like um, in the help of other people's like maybe in lgbt community or some type of another organizations you will help those people's who have a definitely um, battles with the power battles with the you know like um 
they are battling with with the powerful peoples and you are going to be uh, help them okay you will be the always stand in their power you will always stand with them to create a, you know like that power and you will definitely going to be a healer but at the same time with this artist energy you are definitely going to be a inspiration for a lot of people uh, i'm also saying that you could create your own you know agency or some type of organization so you can help new people that new generation to come and to seek an inspiration from you you're definitely going to sign a lot of people uh, i told you with this inner child and mother energy you have this tendency to heal people's maybe through their inner child through their battling within themselves through some type of um you know like um to stand up to, to to maybe you know i feel like you will be you will definitely help them to to guide them uh, how to heal their inner child you could be in in the working of you know healing field okay like some type of uh, healing and transformation you're definitely going to create wonders in people's life and they will be definitely always be grateful for you like what are you doing um you are definitely going to learn a lot of experience meeting these people who are just broken inside and they have this tendency of you know like other issues mental or um, external or whatever um in internal issues with this prince of sword this is you i feel like nobody can stop you you will always on the go you will always be busy you will your mind is always active and you will be performing in these things that is active you could be traveling a lot for your business for your work uh, again throat chakra you are very assertive you know that what people's are intentions are you know where are you going you will know that what you want okay you're not going to maybe you are already wounded in the past or maybe you have this inner child issue that you once you will you know learn this experience and you will fight within yourself then you can also guide other people's that how to fight with this because i almost see with this knight of swords energy is like nobody can come in your way whatever you want okay you will definitely be will be very assertive and you will also be you know stand up for those people you know look at this how is the warrior is battling okay some of you could be in the field of definitely military army police or something you're definitely b okay in this situation or maybe police okay like um helping other people or some type of service uh, you know guard i'm seeing here um yeah i'm definitely seeing here if you're a male watching this video or could be female but i'm seeing this is like a protection like you will be the you will protect yourself you will protect other people's this is your energy like you're definitely going to fight with the people who are battling with themselves internal outernal societal you know social uh, you know like something is definitely you're definitely going to create a lot of things with this prince of swords energy i definitely feel this is like nobody can stop you you know how to save yourself you know how to create a lot of abundance for yourself and you know how to create a new things for you because you are the creator you are the creator of your own life and you are definitely going to do it i definitely feel you are definitely going to create a lot of wonders and inspiration for a lot of people the people who choose this royal blue um uh stone here but there is a definitely struggle here with the powerful people with the politician with the um you know high authority people this is the that's what you are going to battle with them because you're not going to accept any bullshit or anything uh that is not in the favor of the weak people or maybe people maybe you have this tendency to maybe no no maybe you have this um thing you already um you know experience this bully and this this weakness and you don't want to go there you definitely want to help and protect other people okay and with this inner child and mother uh, i definitely feel and with this transformation and learning experience a lot of you you are going to be a therapist or psychiatrist or you are definitely going to be in this field that you are going to uh, help people okay to find their battle but i'm also seeing another situation here is artistic people who are going to flourish in their own arts and they're going to create a lot of abundance for themselves you know you're going to experience a lot of things you're going to you know create your own abundance you're you're definitely going to be a powerful you're going to be uh, outspoken you're going to be recognized because of your work what because of what you what you speak what you say um and what you perform um so this pile is for me performer warrior uh, protector you know um and healer so this is that pile i'm picking up here okay and nobody can come in your way with this mars energy and prince of swords oh my god nobody can you know you nobody can mess up with you this is the what type of person you are okay so mars is also very like a very strict rules regulation disciplines so definitely it could be talking about military army police or any type of fields that you are you know physically performing okay mars is also talking about if you're male you could be in gym or something like building up something and you're going to help other people's to shape their body or something because they are battling with their you know like um 
with your body or something this is what i'm picking up here for the males or women's maybe you guys definitely perform something in the gym so maybe you can shape other people's i'm definitely picking up the from this uh, this group is a shape shifter you're going to shape other people's life and also yours and people will be inspired by this so this is your reading uh so you could be a um, gemini especially gemini libra aquarius air sign is very strongly here and also is a wands fire sign aries leo sag but i'm also getting with this mother earth energy you could be the earth sign too okay you could be any sign but these signs are presence here water sign too i'm picking up here but i'm i'm, I'm almost i'm almost feeling pisces uh, vibes here okay if, if you're an artist okay neptunic vibes here so this is your reading like share and subscribe and let me know in the comments i will see you in the next video bye hello group number two if you choose this beautiful seashell love that right so let's see um what is your life and soul purpose on this planet and what you are mean to do that in this lifetime? I feel when I, if you choose this, it means you're a very introverted person. To be honest, you have a lot of talents, but right now you also don't know about it or maybe you don't want to express it. Because of you shy, because of you introverted, because maybe you are, um, yeah, you're shy, you are introverted, you're a socially awkward person, but you have a lot of talent, I'm telling you. You're hiding it. You're hiding your talent, but you're going to explore it. Let's see. So we have the moon. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Moon. Good. Oh, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have the six of wands. What I told you. Come out of your shell. Fire sign. We have the star. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, moon and star. Moon and star, Aquarius. Oh my god. Oh my god. We have relationship. And from this, we have the love, number six. This is a Gemini card, by the way. From this, we have Smartian. Refines your capacity to help those you would pref prefer to ignore. Oh, my goodness. This is confirmation. You would ignore. We have Virgin. Oh, maintaining symbolic purity of heart and spirit. Some of you watching this video, you are Virgin or you are definitely pure people. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Wait, 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 wait. I'm coming to you. We have the fourth house, so you could be strong cancer in your chart, or, or maybe you have a strong um, fourth house planets. We have the Neptune, what I told you, it's a Pisces. Wow, 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 we have the do the work. Do the work, honey. Oh, I'm excited, we have no. Yeah, look at this. Okay, when I see this pile, I almost felt like you just, I intuitively, feel it like you are hiding to yourself something okay you are use, you are mean to do something i'm telling you you are mean to be star of your own life okay look at this we have this uh, universe is trying to tell you like do the work do the work and you're saying no i don't know if i can do it or not uh, no i'm not sure and uh, no uh, i can't do it you know this is your energy okay you are not believing on your own talents you're not believing um your own skills okay that's what you need to come out of your show we have the moon here oh my goodness you are psychics you guys are psychics you are intuitives you guys here to help uh, you know to other people through your intuitions through your emotions through your feelings through your the flow okay you have knowledge of unknowns okay with this uh, the moon card here and neptune oh my god you have this fantasy world you have this something even though you will speak to someone you will your presence will heal other people's you know you will be just there to help to hear from the peoples uh, you know they will definitely you have this tendency to know people's dark and deep secrets okay with this moon energy and there is no doubt you you're definitely going or you're going to be a witches um you could be intuitive peoples you could be psychics you're going to be like just now i'm doing this is what your life purpose is going to be a psychic going to be an intuitive going to be a healer with a star energy you're definitely going to heal people's wounds you're going to be an inspiration for a lot of peoples to find their way to find their path you know how to heal themselves how how to you know work on their own um, issues your emotional issues their emotional issues with this Neptune energy you are definitely have a God given gift with the moon energy Neptune and fourth house is a cancer all the water sign Pisces cancer Scorpio is presence here Neptune Pisces the moon cancer fourth house is a cancer you guys are I, 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 am, I don't know 
in, in, in a, how to simply put it, you guys are intuitive, you guys are psychics, you, you guys are going to help a lot of people through their, through their family traumas with the fourth house, you know, their inner, inner traumas, their troubles, their roots, you're definitely going to tell them, you will, you will put them in, out of their comfort zone with this Neptune energy, you're definitely going to create this fantasy, this, it's like you know it, you just feel it, and you're definitely going to create a lot of things for the peoples. Some of you, you're going to work in definitely in this Neptune and the moon is definitely psychic and intuitive and occult words, okay? And you will create a, a name, your name for them, okay, with the star card. You're going to be, you're, you will be get the fame, popularity and success in this. And this is your business. This is what you're going to, you know, flourish in this. With the star energy, you're, you, you're definitely going to be inspiration for a lot of people, for healing, for working. And, you know, for new beings that will come to you and they will, they will learn from you. Like, okay, so this person is doing that. I also have to do, you know, choose this path. So you maybe show a lot of people with this Neptune energy to follow their path. You know, subconscious and conscious conscious mind this is what you guys are going to play with uh, so with the neptune is also talking about uh, the presence it's a 12th house by the way so it's just like you guys are very idealistic people people will not believe it people will not believe it what are you saying what are your fantasy what are you trying to do they will not going to believe it but unfortunately they are going to believe it because the more they will resist your 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 popularity, your 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 presence, um, your work, the more they are definitely going to be like, what is this? How this person can you know predict that? How this person can say that? How this person know these all things unknown? Because you know it. This is a natural talent gift that you need to explore. Neptune is also the twelfth house is talking about you know hidden things that is covered from the world. It's unknown, like an eighth house energy, Scorpio. You know, occults. Um, it's also working with I don't know in a graveyard or uh, you know doing. Something some type of crafts i'm also seeing that something is with the like you know that blood moon or full moon or you know the half moon you maybe guys do that things on that um you know maybe you know it or not you're definitely going to you are the creator by the way you are the manifester the great manifester you can create abundance for yourself and you are the path on your success six of wands victory popularity people will follow you people will admire you recognize you you will also have a haters okay so be careful because this is the thing here is it's also the downside of the fame or popularity and success um whatever the field that you will be in because the, the star is definitely fame it's this it's, it's a popularity it's your beauty uh, you could be you will be the model you will be the teacher uh, of in these things okay yeah um, so I'm definitely picking up here you will create a lot of things for other people so a lot of you you going to work in the field of definitely medicines medical healing um, with this Neptune energy obviously in the jails maybe you know to helping other people's and to going to support a lot of people's like you know like communities that um, the people's who are weak they are doing some under uh, you know work like you know like they're not putting up um, things very openly but you're going to support them right and you will understand them like lgbt community uh, are the people who are just you know um fighting for um their rights any any examples like i'm, I'm talking about like the people who are weak the people who are you know like new learners or new b are you know they are you are definitely will be the inspiration for these peoples okay um with this moon energy, you have a lot of emotions and a lot of love to give to the peoples. The love. Okay, so a lot of you, I feel this because these cards came up, I don't want to say it, but we have the love and relationships because it's not a, a love reading. But I feel that you are definitely going to complete this life mission or your life purpose, your soul purpose with your lover, the love of your life, because this is the love of your life, this relationship and love. This could be your soulmate or twin flame. I don't want to give you a hope, but this is someone, maybe your life partner, but this is someone that you will feel this uh, this partnership with and you will like, we can grow up together. You will definitely bring, look at this, you have a definitely a mission for a lot of people. So you will be inspiration for a lot of people, you know, to, um, you will work with pe people, okay? You will definitely create peace, harmony and relationship maybe okay because this is what you guys maybe you both will be the youtubers or psychics or intuitive peoples and you will bring a lot of people together again um some family issues you know some family issues with neptune is also talking about maybe um psychiatrist or therapist or you know like um how to say it like a social activist or something but fourth house is definitely talking about your mother issues your traumas with the moon also mother fourth house is also mother your roots and uh, you know you will definitely going to be help a lot of people to see the people's to tell them to see the different perspective to see the things from your point of view this is what you guys are going to do that and people will be like oh these things exist too they're going to believe it 
they're going to believe it finally okay so yeah i'm definitely feeling with this virgin and smarty and yeah smarty and you're going to work with the peoples even though you are trying to ignore or you don't want to work with them this is what you guys are going to do i told you you are definitely going to have a haters but your haters will be your fans because of your work, because the things that you're creating, because the things that you're going to create with other peoples and collaborate with other peoples. With this orange, I see root chakra. So you will definitely bring a lot of confidence in you. Your confidence, your work, your creativity, your talents will explore to other peoples, okay? And with this virgin, you have this pure heart and pure spirit that people will feel it. Maybe you're virgin, okay? You both will be virgin and you will work with your partner, okay? You both will be virgin. But it could be you will do some, some type of organizations or work and in the field of people who are just, they have a pure spirit. They have a pure heart. They are virgins, right? You're going to protect those peoples. With this do it work, do, you do your work, definitely you are going to. You have a full support from the universe and God. They're giving you the green signal. But this is you. You're not going to believe it. Like, no, you can't do it. So you will be the blockage of your own life and of your life purpose. Don't do that. Just go with the flow. You are meant to be successful and powerful and intuitive and psychics or healers, um, helpers, okay? Life coach, lover's coach, love coach, okay? Guru for those peoples, okay? You're going to create a lot of abundance and you are also going to create a lot of work and projects with those people who are not even, you don't know about them. Like you don't know about them. You never met them, right? You maybe create something on internet, on social media, especially with your lover, with your partner. It does not mean to be a romantic lover. It could be your best friend. It could be your partner, your business partner, but it could be your lover because I'm seeing with this love and relationships, it's your soulmate. It's your twin flame. You have this mission with them. With the moon and star, or they could have this mission with you. Like they could be star. They could be in thing, but this is your life purpose. You are mean to do this work. Are you both are mean to do this work, I would say, okay? But you're not going to believe it, I'm telling you. There's something about you, like you, are, you, you will be not sure about it. But trust me, you have a lot of knowledge and wisdom and unknown things. You and don't know it, why? You have a lot of downloading. You have a lot of dreams. You have a lot of signs. You have a really connect with the God. Because, why? Because you are, you are the virgin. You have a pure spirit. You have a pure heart. You have a pure soul. You don't want to hurt anyone. You will definitely love every human or every living being on this planet that's what is is god-given gift for you you are humanitarian but i would say you love everyone everything you don't judge people and that's what the god is giving you the gift here okay but i'm saying the six of wands is a victory it's, it's overcoming through challenges overcoming through victory over your haters victory over uh, anything that you're go you're battling within yourself and the peoples who are battling with themselves you're definitely going to show them the path the healing path you will show them the right path you will direct them on their life purpose okay and with the moon energy wow this is this is beyond you know these things and people will even though people don't want to believe it they're going to come to you because of your work because of your inspiration because of the way you speak the way you the way you you know connect with the divine and god okay they're definitely going to believe it so this is a very beautiful pile that you choose it but what i'm seeing i told you in the beginning of this reading like you're you're definitely not showing this talent you have a lot of secrets you you do you maybe do these things in in secretly but no universe is saying no you need to come out of your show you need to tell people what you are you need to show your talents, your skills, your this beautiful given gifts, okay? Don't hide yourself anymore. This is what your life purpose is, okay? You need to come forward and okay, okay, and show it to the world that this is you. This is what you're doing. This is what you are. You will be inspiration for a lot of people. But this is like you are coming in your own way, what I'm picking up here. So this is your reading. Like, share, and subscribe. I will see you in the next video. Bye. Hello, group number three. The people who choose this beautiful green stone, I feel that there's something related with the nature, with the related with the medicine, medical field, uh, healing field. I'm also seeing something with the with the, you know, like forest adventures, travel, uh, flowers. I'm picking up here. This is also heart chakra card. So definitely. Yeah, working in the field of any, maybe heart surgeon or heart, heart field or something. We will see. What is this? We have three of pentacles. So you could be the earth sign. We have the princes of pentacles. Yeah, more earth. And we also have, what is this? What is it? The fatality. Oh my God. Why just, wait a minute. This is the devil card, by the way, right? If I'm not wrong. No, it's not devil. 
I will figure it out. What is the 16 number, Major Arcana? Is this sun? Okay. Wait a minute. I will figure it out. We have the trust number zero. This is another major arcana. This is definitely... Um, what, what did it say? It's full, okay? Let's see. Then we have golden memories. Okay. From this, we have the knight. Okay. We have warrior. Oh... Knight and warrior. From this, we have the tech in house. So you could be Taurus. We have the Venus. Wow, Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. Very strong. I told you, Earth sign. So you have a Taurus, Venus. Um, Libra, maybe you Libra. And we have uh, from this, intuition and downloads. Oh my goodness, Venus. Oh my goodness. And then we have healing energy. Okay, this is no doubt here that this is a strong feminine energy in this reading. By the way, this is a temperance. Okay, I got it. It's a Sagittarius card. Okay, another healing card. Oh my God. Oh my God. Why everyone is getting this? So I show you something with the medical healing and we have the Venus. Oh my God. This is definitely talking about in the field of healing, intuitions, you know, downloading. You, you are definitely intuitive people. So you have a strong Venus in your chart. You are the epitome of the feminine beauty. It does not matter you're male or female. But you have this this feminine side is really, really, it's like flowing in you. You have this healing energy. This is what your life mission is, your life purpose is, okay? Connected with the God, connected with the divine. You can see the circle here, completing yourself with other people's, connecting with the emotions, feeling with the Mother Earth, with the nature, okay? And with this intuition and downloads, you have a lot of weird dreams, intuitions and downloads. Sometimes you're, you're, you're always, your mind is active, thinking about the things that you don't want to think, right? We have the Venus. It's, I, it's, it's, it's definitely cherish, it's stability, it's luxury, it's enjoyment, it's a pleasure. But it's again, it's, it's, it's attraction, it's, it's a divine feminine, right, in you. And we have the second house. This is also another card of Taurus. So you are definitely, your life mission is and your, your life purpose um, I would say sole purpose too, because this is what you're, you're used to do that, um, to earn this second house, it's a money, it's a fame, it's a success, it's, it's potential, uh, it's exploring your feminine side and working with your intuitions, with your download, with your energy, 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 energetic healing. Uh, I'm also saying with the Venus, it is, uh, for me, it's an entertainment business, so especially for, you know, like modeling, beauty, beauty products or something, something with the beauty, anything with the beauty, you know, like uh, modeling, um, singing, dancing, a performance, anything with the beauty, artist, um, you could be working with some type of, you could, uh, you know, own this business in this beauty products or some type of, I'm definitely seeing beauty here, um, or you will be the beautician, you know, create the beauty. It's not like you, you, you are this thing, like you, um, your work is the beauty, okay? That's what your mission is, to, to see the beauty in them or yourself and create the beauty, you know, something beautiful, like beautiful, natural, with the, connect with the God, okay? We have the knight, okay? This is talking about loyalty, romance, and assurance, and love of honor. And we have the warrior. Uh, strength, skill, discipline, and toughness of heal, heroism, socialism, and self-sacrifice in conquering the ego. Yeah, look at this. You are the definitely will be a hero, of the peoples okay you will be the hero of the hero or heroines of the society um knight warrior so this is definitely picking up the fields of definitely you know anything that talk about disciplines rules strength it's talking about army police if you're male uh in this field um, but um, it could be you are male but you are working in this field okay like something with the creating some beauty um you know endorsements endorsement of something like advertising of something um working in the fields of um just beauty okay i'm also seeing uh travel involved here whatever your work is you you mean to do that we have three of pentacles this is your work wow look at this fame and popularity there will be a lot of women or people's um look at you your work um your craft your beauty i'm again seeing with the three of pentacles is working with you will be famous in your workplace by the way uh whatever your work situation is it's also talking about hard work you know trying to collaborate with other people's but whatever the work you will do i also feel like i don't know why people People will try to see basically spy on you stalk on you and see that basically what are your hidden talent like what is your 
secret tool that you're getting this success and fame and popularity and everything, you know. So this is these people are curious, like what are you doing that they're not doing? So this is a, what is you will create this thing in the people's like they will be very curious. I, I'm not saying haters. They will be very curious or competitive people. They will also copy you. I feel here because we have the warrior. So you are definitely going to be a warrior. You will create your own abundance. You will trust your path. You are, you are this fool, okay? This is a fool energy. You will be a traveler too, I'm telling you. Like guides, uh, helping other people, to tourists, uh, guides. You make the blogger, blogs or vlogs about something. It's anything that advertising, you know, or tourists or guides. Um, I'm definitely picking up here. Venus is also food. So maybe working in some type of food industry or food or restaurants or foods. I'm also seeing the trust is again, it's a beauty. I'm seeing the jewelry too. So something with the jewelry, beauty, makeup, um, cloths, okay, boutiques. I, I don't know, whatever the work you will guys do, you are definitely, um, but I'm also seeing intuitions, healing energy and the field of, uh, you know, healing and working with other peoples and, you know, working with um, stones, jewelry, healing, medicine, maybe working with the herbs, you know, working with some type of homeopathic things or creating something your own things creating your own oils creating your own products you know introducing something for yourself okay so we have the princes of pentacle this is you you guys all about it's a money it's a finances we have the two of um also the second house so yeah you you have a lot of potential you will have maybe multi business okay um i'm also seeing a beautiful cloths here so a lot of something with the cloths here i'm seeing a lot of colors here so maybe working with the colors or putting the ads in the colors again it's a food thing when we see the variety of the foods, when we see the variety of, um, I don't know, it's just beautiful colors I'm seeing here. Almost it's a very colorful um, pile here. Um, but we have a Princess of Pentacles is talking about creating something for you, abundance and, and stability and security. And, you know, um, collaborating with other people, projecting with other people's um, business. This this is a business wheel. Like, you know your business. You know that how to create for yourself, how to invest your money. Uh, you could be the advertising people, okay? You are watching this video, okay? <laughs> Hello, advertisers. Because I, I get tons of, you know, messages or emails from the advertising companies. Uh, so, yeah, you, you will invest, you know, in people's. Like, you know, you want to... Um, invest the money so people can definitely you want to show your talents your skills your your work that you create right your your crops okay you really want to sell them so this is what you guys are going to do that i'm seeing here you will invest money and you have a lot of potential for other things too we have the um finally it's it's, it's a it's a temperance so you can see that you will be the healer you will be the creators you will definitely bring a lot of healing and you also have the healing energy too temperance is also arts okay and we have the venus i mean come on it's art it's beauty it's it's, it's just uh, maybe you are this this will be in this field or you are going to uh, advertise and you know invest in this field okay like you will see the business you will create a lot of things okay um yeah this could be you guys okay you will definitely want to see that uh, who what person and who person is really good for you for your work for your craft so you can invest in them you see the potential in other people's you have the keen eye by the way uh, for investing for this group okay for your money for your time and uh, you know especially your money your talents we also have the golden memories so yeah you will have a lot of look at this fire so you will have a lot of creativity i'm almost seeing this is like a root chakra and solar plexus chakra and everything mixed here so you guys are very confident people are you you will invest in people who are very confident some of you you will you will definitely invest in something like filming directing um you know film directions um music videos or building selling products advertising again i'm seeing with this night energy romantic things like you know like creating some you know beautiful stuff for romance love and also i'm seeing that in this field of like creating the cloths that couples wears or something like that i love that um, because this is a different pile the trust here is that you will trust the unknown and you will know that what are you doing you will just go flip it okay you're just definitely going to invest it but you will have this leap of faith and trust um and people will trust you because i feel that people will trust your work people will trust your talent people will trust you to invest the money in themselves or with you okay if you will do partnership or collaboration with those people they'll definitely trust you because of your name because of your potential because i feel that this is a field that you're go definitely going to create a lot of things okay um maybe with this night here you could be the poet riot writer romantic singer or romance or writer because this is this is a very creative pile here very very creative 
uh, Venus here. So this is very creative. And the temperance, this is definitely exploring your skills, your talents, your your, and working with that potential, maybe multitasking, multi-business, something like that. And also in the field of energy, healing, divinations, um, yeah, medicine. I'm also seeing here medical field. Look, healing other people's in, in any way, in any way, okay? So that's your pile. Like, share, and subscribe. I will see you in the next video. Bye. Okay, finally, the group number four, the people who choose this beautiful... Uh, curvy shell so this is sip okay like i feel like the people who choose this pile uh, group okay i feel like you guys are rebellious of the society you don't want to fit in you 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 are like the black sheep okay people and you don't want to you just want to beat the drum of your own you know you you just want to your the beat your own drum you don't want to fit in the society you guys are very very creative people you also don't work with other people. You guys are really comfortable working with yourself. Okay, even though you're working with other people in field, you're not comfortable or not agreeing with their ideas because you are outspoken. You, you I'm, I'm, I'm almost speaking like Aquarius vibe from this, from this group. You guys are rebellious, okay? So let's see uh, more. King of Swords. Okay. Okay, Mama. Okay, Daddy. So we have the King of Swords. Oh God, I told you Aquarius, we have Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, you guys are not believers, okay, you are not believers, we have the hangman, oh goodness, oh goodness, Pisces, we have the four of wands, Aries, Leo, Sag, I told you, I told you, we have the flow, number 10, it's a, it's a wheel of fortune, by the way, and then we have tight, what is this, tantric union, look at this, I love this card, I love this beauty, I love this art, I'm the sucker of the arts, okay? Uh, so let's see. We have bully. Oh, I told you. We have the beggar. You are not, you're not going to, nobody can mess up with you. We have the first house. So it's talking about Aries. So you could have Aries strong in your chart, but I'm also seeing Gemini here strong. We have the moon, yeah. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Now let's see from these angels. We have the vulnerability and freedom. Freedom. You're all about freedom. Look at this star, Aquarius. I told you. Freedom. Romance and connections. Wow, I love that. And we also have this energy. Wow. <laughs> I love that. I love this pile. I love this group. Okay, so this is... Uh, you guys are the bullied and beggars of the society. I'm not saying in the way like you're the beggar. You're begging for the people's attention and love. No, 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 no. You know that. You're not the beggar. You don't want to... It's like... Confronts empowerment at the level of physical survival, awakens the spiritual authority of humility, compassion, and self-esteem. This is you. And we also have the bully. Highlights your tendency to intimidate others, helps you conf confront the inter interferes that, bu that, that bully you. So you, you definitely intimidate people. I told you. I told you when I saw, this I saw this shell, I was like, people just got afraid. Oh my God, who's this person? So they, you, have, you, are, you are eccentric. You're different from the people. So it's not like I'm not... I'm not saying that. This is a very different pile. This is, you guys are different. You, you have a life purpose and soul mission on this planet. It's like you will do the things in your own way. You will create, the, the, you will create your own way from the society, different from the peoples. You will be inspiration for a lot of peoples who are just like you. Because we have a very few of peoples who just follow their, you know, their way. Because everyone is, uh, you know, trying to fit in the society and, okay, okay, we will do it. No, 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 no. You're not going to fit it. You're not going to compromise what do you believe and what are you going to do? This is a vulnerability and freedom. You have a strong vulnerability and freedom, so sense of freedom for those people who are the bullied of the society, who don't, who don't want to fit in the society, and you are definitely going to inspiration for those people. And we also have the beggar. For those people who have a differences and they have a struggle to deal with the powers, struggle to deal with the you know, stereotypes of typical stereotypes of the society, you're not going to. You are definitely going to be an inspiration for those people. They will, they're going to follow you. They're going to be like... Because I feel that you have a, some power from the God and divine. Look at this, this angel, this huge angel wing, you know, of you. So you could feel me from the different race, you know, from the black. I'm, I'm seeing here, no judgment, obviously. I'm just, I'm just giving you the, but you could be the white too, white or black. Does not matter, does not matter. They're your, the matter here is that you're going to inspire a lot of people. Your life purpose, your um, life mission, our soul mission, our soul purpose is the, on this planet is to be vulnerable with those people who are bullied of the society, who are intimidated by the peoples or society because they follow their own way, they follow their own path. And people are like, oh my God, 
look at this person. What is this person doing? What is this person speaking up to? Look at this person. But at the same time, when they will see you and they will follow you, like, wow, this person is doing something different. This person is doing something different. This is you are going to be admirable of inspiration for those peoples because you're going to do things differently your own way okay we also have uh we have the moon so you guys are psychics you guys are very very intuitive people some of you you guys you guys bullied because of your emotions um uh, because of your uh maybe and the inner traumas or something maybe bullied by your mother uh you could have a um, coming from the toxic family toxic background bullied by the bullied because of your emotions because some sometimes you know if if I'm, I'm giving an example if a male are you know even the female express their emotions and feeling the other people's like mm, oh my god look at her she's crying she's just you know putting the show off it's or something and in our normal society you know the stereotype society the male if the male cry they're like oh my god you can't be a male you can't be a masculine because you're crying right why the masculine and male is also a human why he can't cry so this is the thing that you're going to fight for. This is the thing that you're going to make the difference in the society. Like, um, you can see the blue here. You're, you're going to speak up. You're going to speak up. And people will listen your voice. Listen. You're the outspoken. You're not going to accept any bully or whoever, the bullying of the person or anything that you will see in front of you, the bully or begging from someone. And you're, not, you're going to stand up for them. You're going to stand up for them. I'm telling you. This is what you are, your life mission is. Um, with the moon energy, you could be the psychics or from the people who are definitely intuitives. You're definitely going to be inspiration for a lot of people in the world of healing, emotions, uh, psychiatrist, therapist, or maybe any type of uh, inspiration. Like for people to, sh you know, like to follow your intuition, to follow your emotions, to follow and flow with your emotions, to follow your own path. You know, this is what you, you have some unknown things here. You're definitely going to express it. We have the first house. Um, now, first house is also talk about uh, it's Aries energy. It's, it's talking about your body, your style, your living. Um, yeah, you you you're definitely going to fight for the people who are like, oh my God, it's just like a you know in typical normal stereotypes of society things you know so beauty standards and uh, your body shape, uh, how you should look, how you should you do that, blah 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 that thing. This is you're going to uh, fight for these people. Like no, I I'm, I'm gonna do my own things. I'm going to do what I will like. I'm going to do what I feel. I'm going to do what I want to say. I'm going to do what I want to do. This is what you guys are going to do that. And this is your mission. First house is also talking about your body. Okay, so maybe in the field of shape shifting of the body, gyms, okay, anything that is related with the physical, the building things, you know, creating things. But it's also talking about your actions, your desires, who you are. This is what you go, our guys are going to do that. You will be very like you. You will be just, just just like you, you know, but your presence is definitely going to intimate a lot of peoples. And the way you speak, the way you will stand up for these peoples and you're, you're going to express it. Oh, my God, this will definitely trigger a lot of peoples. So, by the way, I choose this pile, too. So, you can say me that Aquarius in me is just like that. I don't care what other peoples are doing. I don't compare my life with other peoples. I will do, I will say the things as I do. But it is really intimidating for a lot of people. You can see that people bully me on my planet, on my YouTube channel. And you can see that in the comments too, the haters and the people, I don't care. I don't care, okay? Because I'm coming from this place, so I know that. So people are going to bully you. People are going to put you down like you're doing wrong. You are saying wrong. You should not do that. This is not good. This is not acceptable. But no, you're going to stand up for yourself you know you what you are doing with this your desire your action who you are you you are this truth people need to accept you as you are okay and the people who are just like you okay you will be in definitely uh, inspiration for a lot of people they want to be like you they want to speak up like you they want to they, they want to get this confident they want to get this thing but for some people they are going to support you in this way and that's also the biggest thing here but a lot of people don't have this courage to go the different to this norm of the society but you will go you will go it you will do it i'm um, so also saying with this king of swords energy it's a gemini libra aquarius look at this how assertive you are you are this you have this sword in you you can cut anyone who will come on you or who will speak wrong to you or who will say something wrong to you because you're very analytical you're very logical you are saying the things with your experience you're saying the things what you experience and this is how you guys are going to do that i definitely feel you are going going, going to be a public speaker i'm seeing a lot of blue so it's it's a thought chakra it's speaking it's it's, it's expressing it's writing uh, you know books 
blogs are you know like raising your voice for the peoples and we also have the sword here it's like speaking the truth so any time in it could be that's where the king of swords is definitely represented by the authority figures the people who are in law and justice they speak the truth they make the balance a politician you know you will create these things together or maybe you will be on definitely on a business field like you will be the leader of your own things and you will be the leader of a lot of things um any work that you will do but it is talking about anything that related with the justice speak the truth honest honesty you know that's where you you will go discipline rules this is what you are going because you should you believe in equality you believe in honesty you believe in everyone has right to speak up their opinion you know this is what you you are definitely going to do that we have the hangman so you are definitely going to be um i would say very stubborn in the way like you're definitely going to see the different people's perspective but at the same time you're not going to change you are you okay with this the hangman here you're definitely going to experience a lot of things in a different way you are going to exper experience a lot of <clears throat> human things and natural things i also feel like healing you will go through some spiritual ups and down with a hangman you're definitely going to do everything with your experience to be honest when i saw the 11 11 four of wands i was not getting it because it's not a love reading again i don't want to say it but but we have that we we have we have this tantric union and then we have the romance and connection and we have the four of wands 11 11 so the person that you're going to marry the person that you're going to be your soulmate your twin flame but i feel this is your twin flame you can see that how these are the same people 11 11 just like you protection from the god they are just like you same like you you have a mission on this planet together so they will be same like you now i'm not saying that it could be a romantic partner it could be but it's it's definitely 90% is your romantic partner the person that you have a mission with for a wants it's 11 11 it's a marriage it's commitment it's a union with your soulmate with your twin flame and that's what you guys are going to work on this planet you know with your twin flame with your soulmate you're going to raise the vibration of those people and going to help those people who got bullied who got maybe they got bullied like you but you will have the same experiences you've gone through a lot of hell ups and down and then your time will come and you will be the star and inspiration for a lot of people because you always have a sport you always speak the truth you don't care what other people are you definitely respect other people's opinion but you also spoke and raise your own opinion because you, this is what you believe It does not matter who is against this is is like i don't care who is against me this is that type of energy because i know what i am i'm the truth i'm living in the truth So we have this romance and connection so you're definitely going to create a lot of abundance and work with your partner too they may be in the same field like you but you have the same mission and same soul by the way we have this tantric union again you're definitely create a lot of things and you will be inspiration for a lot of people too you both will be the bullied people and you will be the couple of inspiration maybe you will do work together with also with this type of a person this is definitely again maybe your connection will be um not a you know like normal type of a connection maybe this is different culture religion anything but you will do this thing and you will stand up we also have the four of wands it's 11 11 it's a union it's happiness it's just like look at this burning fire and this is here home something with the home you definitely create a lot of um different perspective about relationships home society you are definitely going to do the things in your own way i'm picking up here and the ne last card is flow so this is your destiny 10 completion you're definitely going to go with the flow with your own life okay even though you're working alone you don't don't care this is a wheel of fortune bringing luck bringing abundance bringing change you are meant to bring this change in the society in the community in 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 other people's life in other people's home so this is what you guys are going to do because it's a wheel of fortune turning the things the hangman seeing the thing in the different perspective so people will do that they will be forced to do the thing is to do or see the things from your point of view okay but there will be a lot of people who will bully you or you will cross a lot of things but ups and down no matter what you're definitely going to stay in your power this is what your your mission is this is what your life purpose is to go with the flow and do the things in your own way always speak up your truth always raise your opinion and stand up for what you believe and stand up what you want to do we also have the flow here is talking about um 
flow of the money, flow of the abundance, flow of the peace, flow of connecting with the divine. You have a very spiritual and connected um, divine connection. And with this um, Wheel of Fortune in, in, in Tarot deck, it's also talk about, you know, destiny, mean to be that. So this is definitely we're talking about. What is your destiny, life purpose or mission? You're destined to do these things with your par partner, with your soulmate, with your twin flame, okay? This is what you guys are going to do that. So this is your reading. Like, share, and subscribe. I will see you in the next video. Bye.